So here we are at Central World Golf Course at the U.S. Senior Open, and I'm joined by Robert Trent Jones, Jr., Robert, the architect for this place. Uh, you were a part of the original build in 1982, and again, the renovation in 2013. What is it like to see this place on a national spectacle now? Well, it's fabulous. This is, golf's a patient game, so you have to wait a long time to get at a, a USGA National Open, but it's here. And I, I think all the fans will come and enjoy themselves if they take advantage of this wonderful weather and, and the immo immaculate condition the course is in. Yeah, so some may be wondering why we have this umbrella here. And you <laughs> brought this with me. Can you tell me why? Well, we couldn't go to the flower hole because the tournament's there. So we brought the flower hole to you. And there it is, famous flower hole at Century World, which we designed with John Jonas in 1982. Yeah. One of the things that's interesting in the golf world, you may know, is that because of the Century Golf Course, it was a iconic course that others copied, sort of set a new standard for Wisconsin golf. And therefore, Wisconsin is the it state for golf right now. So come and enjoy it. Yeah, that's awesome. And you speak about Wisconsin. What was you know your, your vision and your planning process in making this place uh, a spectacle for people to come and see? I know the state pretty well, having worked throughout it. And it's one of, I think, the most beautiful states in the country. And golf is about beauty as well as about challenge and, and, and so on. You can travel throughout the state, have a lot of good experiences, but you've got to start with Century World. Yeah, especially as it pertains to your Mona Lisa on 16. I hear there's an old tale of you walking the grounds with the Century CEO at the time. He sees 16 and says, you know, Robert, this, this hole is a little boring to me. And you had an interesting response, didn't you? I did. Well, he was into style. So I said, well, uh, John, I just came back from France, and you're a Fr uh, French heritage in this state. And uh, I saw lots of flowers planted behind the green at saint Cloud in Paris. And I said, we could decorate the hole and make it a little more bright. And I went away, and he, I'd drawn a little pond in front of the green, and he, which had been dug out. Uh, when I came back, not only had he put the flowers around the back of the green, but in the pond. And thus, uh, a collaboration was formed to create the iconic flower hall, which had never been done before in golf. And, is, is, remains a special treat for those who come to see it and hopefully don't hit their ball in the flowers. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. And where does this rank in terms of all of your projects that you've done? Very high, near the highest. Anytime your peers, the USGA, United States Golf Association, acknowledges your work as worthy, together of course with the many, many people who make it so, uh, in such great condition of taking care of it all these years, Century Insurance Company itself, that, that's the highest, it's kind of like the Academy Award for, for doing a, a really good job in a create, creative uh, film. Well, that's great. Thank you so much for taking the time to join us. We appreciate your company. That's a wrap on our coverage for now from Century World. Be sure to stick with us for continuing coverage throughout the weekend. Reporting for Newswatch 12 in Stevens Point, I'm Matt Weaver.